In this tutorial you will learn how to create a chiseled text effect using Adobe Illustrator. It's a pretty short tutorial, so staying with us to this journey. Open the Adobe Illustrator CS6. Press Ctrl plus N to create a new document. Enter 800 in the width box and 400 in the height box then click on there, advanced button. Select RGB. Screen 72 ppi and make sure that the align new objects to pixel grid box is unchecked before you click OK. Draw a rectangle 600 px width and 300 px height and fill it in the color RGB color value, 169, 171, 174. Type the text that we will work with. And set the font family and font size as your wish. Here I have set the font family new Nito and font size is 100px. Disable the fill in the tools panel and open the appearance panel, window, appearance. Create new fill by pressing the corresponding button in the appearance panel. Apply the screen blending mode to this fill as opacity 100% and type is screen. Replace black color with gray, here I have used the RGB color. 169, 171, 174. Apply the Gaussian blur effect to the fill effect, blur, Gaussian blur. Here I have, set the radius, 2px and, you can check the preview, to see the final result, that you apply right now. Duplicate the fill by clicking duplicate the current item. Replace the color of the drop fill with a darker shade, of the base color, and apply the multiply blending mode to this fill. Keeping the drop fill selected, go to effect, distort and transform, transform, and set the horizontal and vertical move value 4px. You can set this value depending on your text. Add a new fill by clicking add new fill and set the fill color, which color matches the color at the background. Here I have set the RGB color 169 171, 174. Select this fill, then go to Effect, Distort and Transform, Transform, and set the horizontal and vertical move values to px that are half than in the previous transform effect. Congratulations! You have done embossed text effect. That was pretty easy. Moreover, your text is still editable. Embossed text effect technique is more useful we can create a graphic style. Select the text and press the new graphic style button in the graphic style panel. Now you can apply to graphic style to other fonts and even to other shapes and objects. Simply select some text or other vector paths and click the thumbnail of the graphic style you just created. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and subscribe for this video.